The rotary vein style actuator is a very, very compact design in space envelope as well as weight. Behind me, I have a automated three inch high performance butterfly valve with your traditional rack and pinion spring return pneumatic actuator. Adjacent to it is the Easy Torque pneumatic actuator with a six inch high performance butterfly valve that's twice the size going from a three inch to a six inch and look at the space comparison. Just how compact these not only butterfly valve packages are but ball valve packages as well. For sake of proving this to you, again, this is a six inch high performance butterfly valve. The actuator is sized for 150 pound worst case service, dry service, sized for 60 pounds of air available for actuation, fail safe design. Look at the size of that. This is showing a three inch valve with a rack and pinion actuator. If this was a six inch valve, this actuator would be, yep, you got it, that big, 21 inches. Imagine, look at the difference between this from here to here on a same six inch valve versus here. Look at that. It's such an, an, a, an unbelievable, compelling visual all of our packages can be either fail safe, look here, it says FS for fail safe, or double acting. To reverse this from being fail safe, we simply unscrew the Allen head screw here, rotate this 180 degrees, and you have to back that out a little bit, and now that and now this is double acting. Another standard feature with the solenoid valve that is supplied with the Easy Torque vein style actuator is the manual override. Use a flat head screwdriver, put it in there and turn it and you have a manual override. This will allow you to stroke the valve opened and closed a couple of times so long as air has been fed to the actuator. This manual override will still work even if air is not currently being supplied to the actuator or if power is not being supplied to this solenoid. You still get the manual override as a standard on this solenoid. Another very nice feature, especially on high performance butterfly valves is reversing the action in the field. In other words, taking a valve from being air to open to air to close. On your traditional rack and pinion style actuator, you need to take the end caps off, you need to open up this valve, turn the valve, put the end caps back on, a very, very laborious process. With this device here, I'm going to show you, we simply take the solenoid that is a Namur direct mount solenoid that mounts to this actuator, and if we so choose to reverse the action, we simply take this off, rotate it 180 degrees, put it back on like that, and we have just reversed the action from air to open to air to close. This uh, only takes a matter of one to two minutes time as opposed to with your traditional rack and pinion style actuator, it can take up to a day on very large high performance butterfly valves. To shop valves, speak to an engineer or find other great valve resources, visit valveman.com. We have been engineering and providing valves and instrumentation solutions for over 50 years.